three. If you need to get something in a Ziploc baggie and you only have the use of one hand, this video is for you. Okay, the first thing you want to do is open your, your Ziploc bag. Now, Ziploc, the actual brand, makes it very easy now because they make one side of the baggie a little taller than the other. And that is the side that you want facing your body when you're opening it. Now, if you don't have a Ziploc that has the little extra height, the, I have found that, at least for me, the channel that is, I'm going to call it the male side, the protruding channel, is the side that I want towards me. I just find that that's easier. Now, if you're not sure which channel it is, try opening it. If it's hard, turn around. Open it again. One of the ways will be easier and you'll figure it out, okay? So now, if you want to put something kind of big or even tiny in the, the, the problem with a, a baggie is that it doesn't stay open. So this little low tech but definitely works system, two little, little um, clothespins. I use plastic ones so if I have to wash them I can. So put one clothespin on one side, flip it over. Put the other clothespin on the other side. And then once both clothespins are on, I basically just open up the mouth and have each clothespin fall to the side because that weights it and keeps it open. There we go. Now it's ready. Oh, that's going to fall. Sorry. I'm going to flip this around so that the container does not fall. There we go. Okay, so then you just stick it in the opening, pull off one of your clothespins, pull the second one off, and voila, you have your big bulky item in your, in your baggie, and then you just have to seal it. All one-handed. Didn't use the other hand at all. Stay happy, everybody.